Hey, what's going on guys? Back again with uh, Tech Vitamins and today the doctor is prescribing Cyanogemod 7.1.0 stable for the uh, Samsung Nexus S. Now, uh, this is not a uh, full review. Uh, what I'm doing is just highlighting some of the uh, newest uh, features that I think uh, are going to be the uh, best best upgrades uh, so far. And uh, let's go ahead and uh, jump on in here. And when we uh, bring up the phone, uh, first thing you guys are going to uh, notice is the uh, new lock screen. Uh, on the right, you uh, still do have the uh, quick option for your sounds, but it's uh, laid out in this new little bubble feature. You just uh, touch it and then drag to the left to silence it. And then if you want to go back to sound on, you drag it to the uh, left again, and then on the uh, left-hand side, you drag the uh, lock to the right to unlock it. Now uh, what this lock screen has, uh, new lock screen has also brought is uh, gestures that you can do, but uh, we'll get to that here in just a second. Um, so let's go ahead and unlock that again here. Um, what uh, CM uh, 7.1.0 brings is uh, an up update to uh, Android 2.3.7 and uh, I'll go ahead and show you guys here 2.3.7 and it uh, does also update uh, the kernel uh, kernel version 2.6.35.13 but um, that's not what I'm using I'm using the uh, NetArchy uh, 1.3.7 completely fair scheduler uh, kernel uh, so so yeah up to uh, 2.3.7 in the uh, new kernel um, we also have uh, updated the, uh, or, or they have also updated the uh, super user uh, application uh, to super user 3, 3.0. And uh, let's see here. So we'll jump back to the uh, lock screen gestures. These are, these are real cool. I like these a lot. Uh, so what I've done, I've already set up a, a, a gesture for uh, unlock which is uh, just a U. So as you can see I draw the U and it uh, unlocks the screen. And to set these up it's real easy. We'll uh, pull up our settings. We'll go to CyanogenMod settings and we'll go to lock screen and lock screen gestures. Um, now to set them up click build gesture. You can already see that I've got my little scribble U in there for uh, for unlock now we're gonna we're gonna add a gesture let's add it for uh, we, there's already a preset one here we're just gonna make it for flashlight so it's nice and quick and we're just gonna make an F and then to show you that that guy works there you go you've got the flashlight on and we'll go ahead and turn that back off See, and now it is off. Uh, so, so that that's real cool. I like that a lot. Uh, what they've also done is added in a way to uh, have a different wallpaper for your lock screen. That's uh, that's in the uh, same place as well. Go back to lock screen or you know, display. Where is that guy? Ah, so there it is. There we go. We go lock screen, and then it is under style options, and you can choose a uh, just a color fill, custom image, or uh, your regular uh, wallpaper will uh, be displayed on the lock screen. So that is also a uh, nice new little feature as well. Um, another another one that has been uh, long long awaited but I've I've been able to use for uh, for quite some time because I've been using the uh, nightly version is the screenshot via long pressing your power button. That just uh, comes in handy. You don't have to uh, hook the phone up to the computer or download any third-party programs now to uh, get screenshots. You can can do that, and it will uh, pop them into a folder in your uh, gallery. 
what what else have they added? They've also added a uh, little little sneaky feature, if you will. Uh, you have the option to mute the uh, camera shutter sound uh, while leaving uh, other system sounds and notification sounds active. Uh, you'll do that. You'll uh, open up your settings and you'll go to your CyanogenMod settings and sound settings and then right there you can mute the camera shutter uh, but they give you a little little warning that it is illegal in some areas but uh, oh well, well we'll take the chance right uh, so so yeah that's uh, that's pretty much uh, you know the uh, biggest features that that uh, that would be most useful to uh, to us um, oh and uh, also um, what uh, CM 7.1 brings is a uh, uh, the uh, also brings CyanogenMod Mod 7 to uh, over about 20 new Android phones. So that's that's great to see them um, upping uh, or increasing the devices that this uh, awesome ROM is available on because it, it it really it really is awesome with with the level of customization that you're that you're able to do. Uh, so uh, yeah, also also. Um, the uh, stock launcher for uh, CyanogenMod 7 is uh, ADW Launcher, and uh, they've also bring a, a few tweaks to that to improve scrolling and uh, some other fixes as well. So, so yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, like I said, all the uh, all the coolest new features so far for CyanogenMod 7.1.0. And uh, thanks for watching. And uh, comment down below and subscribe up at the top. All right, take care, guys. Bye.